finally leaving the rat race. I quit my banking job last month and not a single person, besides my partner, supported my decision, the money was good, but I spent every waking hour working on spreadsheets, commuting in traffic, or having anxiety-inducing nightmares about projects that needed to be finished for a company that doesn't care about me. After one last mental breakdown, I decided enough was enough. After 10 years of the grind, I'm finally done. I sold my house and moved out to the country with my husband. I work for a non-profit organization that helps the local elderly community get to their medical appointments on time. I make 25% of my former income and only work a few days a week. But I can definitively say that I feel happy and fulfilled for the first time in years. My former colleagues think I'm crazy. But they never cared about me anyways. For anyone out there thinking of making the leap of quitting, but afraid of what society might think of you, go for it. Money isn't everything your boss wants you to think it is. This is my dream move. Congrats on starting a happier life for yourself. You drop this crown. I'm 42. Actually love my job and still said what am I doing? I have no kids. And don't want any. I live in the USA and I'm off to Kenya in July after a good friend's wedding in Spain and from there I'm just going to wing it. If 60 year old me has to work at CVS. Fine. I'm not wasting the good years of my life and the idea of living until I'm 80 has zero appeal. You've got this. It doesn't matter what they think. Lol I read this has worked for decades and now can afford to retire. Good job. Congratulations. I appreciated how real your post is. Very well off people can afford to quit their jobs and spend months or years deciding what to do next. It sounds like you had to make major adjustments to your assets and finances. But you are much healthier and happier. I'm glad you included those aspects of your story those of us without a ton of savings definitely have to think carefully about that stuff when quitting or changing jobs and careers. What happened with you husband's job? If you sell a house in an inflated market and then are willing to move, you can get a lot of house for your dollar. I recently semi-retired to central Kansas. Not for everyone. And I got a 2BR for $123,000 in a very nice neighborhood. Friendly people. Low crime. How did you afford to move and how do you make enough now to support that? I've quit 100k plus a year jobs many PPL especially those who don't have those type of jobs get mad about. It. Peace of mind is more important than a piece of cash. Your job do not care about you that much. You can always start your own business. Make the type of money you were. Close or even more and still have your own free time and peace. Congrats BTW. I want to do this. Good for you. Great that you found a less stressful, fulfilling job and peace of mind. Unfortunately we all have different priorities. Some of us have family, kids, tons of debt, cannot own a house, no assets, thus making it impossible to make a change like yours. So we got to keep on working. Anyhow congrats for making the move and having the courage to do it. Can I be that guy? Out of curiosity? How much is 25% of your former income? How did your cost of living change and how much did you make on the sale of the house? Takes a while to realize the rat race isn't worth your happiness and well-being but glad you got. There. I'm putting in my resignation in the next week. I'm interviewing for another position next week and I don't want them to see that I already. Resigned in case they google me and see they're hiring for my position. If that doesn't work, I'm going, hopefully, work at a coffee shop because I love being a barista.
I'll make 50% of my income now but I've been at my now job for 6 months and I've complained every day. I just have to get through this next week. Congratulations! Exclamation mark! Exclamation mark! Enjoy your new stress-free life! Exclamation mark! Exclamation mark! Applause! I'm a week away from drop kicking to the curb this multinational corporation rated most ethical company 2020 that I work for. I hate them with a passion and they are most definitely not the most ethical company. I had a big paying job I walked away from too. It's not worth the stress. Good for you and making yourself happy. I'm not ready for the country I'm just starting over in something that will pay well someday and I'm planning on working for myself one day. Anyone opposed to UBI is having a nightmare at this scenario. There's so many people who want to work full-time but can only get part-time hours and others who can only get a job working 40 hours a week and hate it. Your employer dictates how you work. Often regardless of how productive you are. I'd trade some pay for reduced hours. But that's not the job. So. I sit at a desk for 8 hours a day effectively doing nothing for much of it because those are the rules. Great decision. Made a similar one leaving my job as an underappreciated. Overworked mental health therapist and moved out to a farm in the county. Best decision for my happiness. Screw everyone who didn't see our vision and support us up. Inspirational. I'm almost jealous but then I remember we are here to lift each other up. Based up. If you enjoyed this video, please check out our playlists full of similar content. Epic Heracast is like doom scrolling for your ears. Please like, share, and subscribe.